Hi, it's great to be with you for assembly again today. And we're continuing with the Lord's Prayer. And we've come to that line, deliver us from evil. Deliver us from evil. And we're going to look at another picture this morning to start off with. In fact, I've got two paintings to show you and they're on the wall behind me. So let's take a closer look. And here we have another painting by my friend Lucy Metcalf and she's painted it in watercolour but on canvas. So it's quite faded. It's got that faded look about it. And it's a lovely painting, I think. It's of a picture of a rainbow through the streets. And it looks like it could be my street, in fact, Trinity Rise, but she painted it a long time before we moved here. So I think it's just a street somewhere in England, maybe in London, and there's a rainbow above it. And if we go to the second picture, which is up here, We've got a mountain, haven't we? This is the top of a rocky mountain. And look, there's a rainbow here as well. And if you look at the two pictures together, it kind of looks like the rainbow starts in one place in the city and comes down in another place on top of a mountain. It's as if this rainbow, when you put these paintings together, it's as if this rainbow is covering the whole earth, you could say. Isn't that a wonderful thought that the rainbow, which symbolizes God's goodness towards us, is covering the whole earth? Now, Jesus taught us those lines, deliver us from evil. And sometimes when things are going badly for us, it's like being in a torrential downpour, the Skies are dark and black with clouds. The rain is thundering down. Maybe the sounds are, are loud around us and the lightning is flashing around us and it's quite terrifying. And we wonder when it'll stop, when we'll come out of it. And then eventually the clouds pass, part and the sun comes out. And very often that's when we see a rainbow. And so these paintings remind me of God's goodness towards us and that he will always deliver us from evil. So what does evil mean? What does evil mean? You might think it just means something to do with evil spells or goblins or demons or witches and wizards and things from stories. But evil is all around us in our real world. It's anything that bad that happens. Um, so you might see things on the news, you might see terrible wars, or you might see terrible famines that happen. These things happen and they are bad. You could say they're evil. You might see evil on our streets when people get beaten up or even murdered. Sometimes evil things happen, bad things happen, even in the safety of our own homes. So that darkness that we call evil can happen in many places and many different ways. But Jesus said in his prayer that we should pray to God, deliver us from evil. And as I said last week, the Lord's Prayer is full of different lines that God will always say yes to. So when we pray, deliver us from evil, we know that his answer is, yes, I will. It may not happen immediately, just like the rainstorm, the thunderstorm may not be over immediately, but eventually it will come to an end and the rainbow will come out. And so to the actions for our Lord's Prayer song for deliver us from evil are this, but deliver us. It's like, as if you had chains holding your wrists together and you're going to push them apart. But deliver us from evil. So there's two parts. The first part is throwing your hands up into the air in freedom. And the second part goes like this. You just, your fingers just go down 
And that to me is like ashes falling to the ground. When you've had a bonfire, do you notice there's little sparks and ashes fly up into the air and then gradually they find their way down to the ground because that fire is completely extinguished. It's over. And the evil, uh, the power of evil when God breaks it is like something that's just been burnt to cinders and floats to the ground. It's over. But deliver us from evil. Here's the picture. And now let's sing the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Mm -hmm. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Next week, it'll be for the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, sometimes it feels that there's so many bad things against us that we're as if we're in a thunderstorm with those dark, dark clouds never ending and the rain pouring down cold around us and we just can't see when it's going to finish. But Lord, we thank you that you will always deliver us from evil, that all those evil and bad things around us will eventually come to an end. So help us to always, every day and in every way, continue to have faith in you, even when it feels like darkness is all around us. Help us always to keep our hope set on you and your deliverance. Amen. See you next time.